Hi, welcome to the Market Alert for Thursday the 5th of January 2017. So yesterday we saw the market uh, open quite strongly and what I've done here is substitute the red line that I had for the 76% retracement in the daily chart to a amber orange one to alert where there's some potential weakness and I just obviously transpose this across into uh, this chart. So let me just move forward here, you can see the market breaking through it and then immediately returning back and we know this is a major resistance area we've spoken about this since returning back on uh, Tuesday and you can see there the market then putting in a sell signal and eventually the market breaking the 9900 and trading down to the scalp there the market then finds support and then we sit in limbo land for the remainder of the session you can see there the market coming back above the 76% retracement the orange line there and then waiting for the Federal Reserve this was a, a non-event wasn't it I mean blimey I've never seen such a, a lackluster reaction to the FOMC minutes it took uh, some time before the market actually put in this uh, buy signal the market went through we're above the 76% and then it starts to come back down towards it and then just before the close we see the market uh, moving higher there and allowing you to get out a break even if you wanted to. You've got resistance there at the 19,990 uh, but eventually the market then decides to come back as well. So how this looks uh, in the completed picture we just go to the daily chart you'll see that this is only just as I was recording as the market come back down through the uh, the stop on this uh, particular trade but you can see how it came back above the 76 and then it became a resistance they tried to move it through and now it's back down again so another failed attempt at not only the 20,000 but uh, keeping the market above the 76 percent retracement there as well in the daily chart you can see exactly what's happening we've got this resistance the market sideways still above the 20 bar average the volume has dropped off during yesterday's session and now we're seeing a bit of weakness here so will we get above the to uh, get to the 20,000 well not until we break convincingly above this 76 percent area and we've seen this uh, this week and again that's why I transpose this across because it's so crucial to actually break the 19,925 level news wise today what have we got um, We've got uh, crude oil inventories out at 4 p.m., ISM manufacturing at 3 p.m., and then everything else is out before. Both high impact news items, but an hour apart, so it'll be interesting to see how the market reacts at this time. Again, you'll get uh, half an hour's worth of activity beforehand. And then in the implied uh, volatility dropping nicely, 10.35, this is uh, indicating that the market could move to the upside. You can see this in the chart here. And that's really all there is to report. Uh, the only thing I can say is that the downside uh, obviously is going to be restricted at the moment unless something of a geopolitical nature comes in. Otherwise you grab the money or lock in the money as it moves down. But the upside, uh, there's, there's still this, uh, you can still sense and a sort of a gut feel that they're going to still have a run at the 20,000 level. Right, that's it uh, for me for this morning. I will report in as and when. Other than that, uh, as ever, thanks for your support and also for watching. See you in the next one.